Regarding the question of bias, you know, I hear that and it's easy, uh, it's easy to, to see where a group of, of academics might lean in one particular ideological direction and that could sort of manifest itself in different ways, um, but, but not, um, not necessarily uh, purposefully. It, it, would just, no. it would just occur. Correct. And, and then I read your brief and, and discovered the APA's Committee on Lesbian, Gay, and Bisexual yeah. Concerns. Yeah. And I, I, was just, I was just stunned. I was, could, could, mm -hmm. I, it, it seems to me, if I'm understanding this correctly, it's, it's as if uh, uh, an academic journal um, on the environment, like nature, had a special committee, the Oil and Gas Industry Concerns Committee, and that every report that Nature was going to publish had to go through this committee and ensure that it, it didn't in any way infringe on the interests of that particular ideological group. Is that true? I mean, is that a fair comparison or analogy to what we're talking about here? Well, I, I don't know if I'd characterize it like you do, but the, certainly the facts that you're stating are correct. The, in uh, 19... Uh, 85, they uh, formed a committee on um, uh, uh, lesbian, gay, bisexual concerns, and in 1991, I think it was, they published a uh, report, uh, a set of norms, uh, which were adopted by the APA, uh, to prevent um, what they originally called homophobic research, and then they changed the name to heterosexist research, uh, and now they've changed the name again to heterosexual research. So they have a policy against what they call heterosexual research, which means research that looks at um, uh, uh, males and females uh, it, it coming together in a heterosexual relationship as the majority or normative form in our society uh, and doesn't consider uh, or structure it, it, the research in such a way that could, it could also include or does not denigrate those who uh, do not relate in that particular way. Um, and so if you're going to compare same-sex families with some other set of families in an APA study, you can't compare them with opposite-sex married families because that would be heterosexual or heterosexist, right? Um, so that means that the kind of findings that I've shown you couldn't be done, that, that re kind of research couldn't be done. Uh, in those settings. So yeah, it is, um, you can read it as, as very biasing. Um, I'm, not, I'm not sure that I w would want to make that claim here, but um, it could be.